I want to show you one of the many things that get inside drainage systems and cause problems. So you might be wondering, what is all that buildup? It's coming from somebody's basement. Those lines are sump pump discharge lines. We got one running right now. Well, they're both actually showing that you can see this buildup. Certain mineral deposits and certain soil bacteria cause this. And yes, that will eventually plug the pipe. If you're not routinely cleaning it and having it jetted out, it'll start building up and it'll get really hard. When you're putting in um, concrete, you have those steel iron stakes that are pointed. We've used them. We've used them and just tried to you know, literally open up pipes, you know, try to pound, you know, through the mineral deposits or the, the soil bacteria that's built up. And when it's not routinely cleaned, and it's allowed to build up, it'll eventually just plug the pipe and you can't get nothing through it. It's it's the hardest substance I've ever seen. So people are always asking all kinds of questions in the comments and I'm like, you have no idea the things that we run across. You have no idea what I'm thinking about when I'm building my systems. Now I like to build all my French drains with two pipes in the bottom. Now you see why. If something happens and some of the inlets are compromised, at least if I'm running two pipes, I'll probably still draw the water in as good as I would with one perfectly good pipe that's been unmolested with some sort of calcium buildup, iron oak, iron ochre. There's just so many different things that we, we see and we run into. That all of these basement sump pumps that one has the buildup. This one has the buildup. This one has the buildup. And there's nothing you can do about it. It's usually minerals in the water or bacteria in the soil. You just got to do maintenance. You got to jet your stuff out regularly if you know you have that or one day your line is just plugged. If you enjoyed this video, give us a thumbs up. It supports the channel. If you have any questions regarding this installation, leave them in the comments section. I'm your host, Robert Sherwood, and until the next video.